officially in the elevator going up ninth floor, big New York. Yes. Like real insiders. Guys, here we are with Kyle Bergman, the partner at Big New York. Hello. Thank you. Uh, you are. We've met already once in Frankfurt. I want to say that, and uh, now we're meeting in New York. I'm very happy to meet you, and this time we're officially visiting the New York office. So you're gonna take a little around. Yes, would love to uh, show you a little bit behind the scenes of uh, Big New York and what we've been up to. Okay, so let's go around and check what is in here. We're here in the uh, gallery of uh, Big New York, which is actually made up of two sides. One side is the archive of all of the projects that we've ever worked on at Big New York. And then the other side, which you can see over here, is the, uh, the samples of uh, materials that we incorporate into the projects. So when you just look through the shelves here, uh, you can see that we're looking at a variety of scales, large sort of urban scale uh, projects, uh, and then also looking at sort of how we individually go through the kind of discovery and conceptual kind of phase of any project. And you can see through all of these shelves a large variety of projects. And uh, you can even see the sort of presentation models uh, this is uh, a great project that we uh, actually have designed uh, in Chicago um, and was presented right before COVID, so that's still in the process. Um, and then here you can see the sort of range of materials that we integrate into these projects, some of which we've designed ourselves. So this is uh, the silverback lamp uh, for Lewis Poulsen uh, and some lamp designs that we're actually in the process of doing as well. Um, and also in this gallery is actually projects that we just completed. So this is the uh, Google Bayview headquarters, uh, and this is the, the sort of squome uh, designs, where uh, under one of these uh, sort of larger scale uh, squomes, there are anywhere from two to 3,000 people uh, working uh, for Google. And there are about four of these squomes uh, that are just coming to uh, Mountain View, California. And right behind me is the, the sort of, uh, the, the, uh, the solar PV panels that we've been actually developing just for this project. And uh, you can see we do sort of one-to-one -one mock-ups so that we can test out uh, how these things are constructed. And then there you can see an image of actually those same shingles as they are uh, installed in the Google Baby project. Here are a couple of our New York projects that we're working on. Uh, the first is River Ring. Uh, this is uh, actually a project that's in Williamsburg, just up the coast. It offers kind of a, a different approach to resiliency, a softer coastal resiliency as, a, as opposed to sort of a hard wall. Um, and then on the resiliency side, this is uh, also a project called Big U. And that's the sort of first two and a half uh, miles of the Big U that we're uh, very happy is under construction. We started the project about eight, nine years ago. And, um, and this is the sort of portion that goes uh, along the Lower East Side um, and is uh, going to be completed by 2026. Here are just a few other projects that are kind of more on the urban scale. Um, a baseball stadium in Oakland, uh, where we're actually not only developing the stadium itself, but also the city that's uh, developing around it. Um, something new for New York is a uh, film studio where we actually stack the studios, one on top of the other. Um, and this is together with Robert De Niro. Um, and we're further developing the ideas on the floating city. So this is something that we're doing together with uh, UN Habitat. And uh, this is now developed in Busan, South Korea, uh, where we're going to actually build a prototype uh, that will test the technologies before it is uh, scaled up. And then, uh, you know, we actually have a wonderful um, space that we uh, also use for our lunches or programs. Uh, we hold lectures here. Uh, we have something called Big Picture, where we invite people to come in and inspire us. 
Uh, we also do big schools where big bigsters that are here uh, are actually teaching one another the tricks and the trades uh, and the skills that they have mastered uh, to each other. So that's a great way to kind of share knowledge and, uh, and learn a lot from one another. This is for the beer, this is for the Friday bars and just, uh, you know, you, you sort of work hard and you play hard as well. And uh, that's a big part of big culture is to also uh, enjoy uh, the time that we're together. Um, and then, you have, of course, we were looking at the big view. And the big view is happening right across the water, right here. So you can have the, you have the Manhattan Bridge right there in the background. And, uh, you know, sea level rise and water issues are actually very, very important to the entire city. So being able to sit here and work on a project that you know will impact the very edges of New York, uh, where we have our office, is something that's very, very uh, both wonderful and, and uh, important to us. You know, we are able to work uh, in Manhattan on a range of scales, uh, from sort of planning downtown Brooklyn uh, to the edge of New York City. But we're, we're also very interested in sort of helping the city sort of think about the future. Uh, and so this is another uh, scale of sort of interventions of coming up with ideas. Um, this, this interest in sort of, uh, I think the urban scale is something that has been with Big uh, and Bjarke since, you know, he first started uh, Big and plot before that. Uh, this of course is the Super Keelan project where in Copenhagen, that was looking at sort of a, a one kilometer long uh, strip uh, that you know was was really sort of no man's land and uh, and, and giving it a soul, giving it a place uh, that now is the heart of uh, these these communities. So what you have right behind is what we call the mini big world, and uh, these are kind of all of our projects that are uh, built or in construction and uh, at one uh, similar scale. Uh, so you can see the sort of range of work, uh, the scale of the projects, the, the, the range of typologies that we're working in. Um, and it's just a, another great way to kind of connect with uh, the work. Some of the ones that you probably know are the eight house right here in the center, the mountain behind it, um, or the Copenhill project that's just uh, here. Um, that again shows the sort of buildup of scale or the VIA project, which is the first project uh, that brought us right here to uh, New York. Okay, Kai, thank you very much for the awesome tour uh, in New York. Um, we can confirm that the office in Copenhagen uh, looked quite similar and we were and lucky enough to visit many of the projects live to see the one-to-one -one scale model and they turn out very cool. We're also lucky that we live in a city where we have Yomi Tower, also a big project. And uh, as you are coming in November, as, I, as far as I know, around that time of the year in Frankfurt, you're welcome for a long for conversation on the Creative Insider podcast, where we're going to ask you then the, the harder questions, maybe, <laughs> or we'll have more time to ask you different questions uh, about behind the scenes at uh, an office like Big and uh, what led you to become partner here and all the story. But um, thank you very much for this introduction and hope to see you in November. I look forward to it and uh, see you all uh, in a few months. See you. Bye bye from New York.